everybody. This is Kara, aka the Principal Painter, and this evening I have an unbagging and unboxing for you. You'll have to excuse the band-aid on my finger. I uh, had a slight injury while cooking. I am cooking Thai basil chicken for Marlin tonight. We're gonna have kind of a dinner date, and um, I videoed uh, me cooking it. I don't know if there's any interest in seeing that video on how I make Thai basil chicken. It's a it's an easy recipe. Yes, there is some prep, but uh, it's not it's not too bad and it's delicious. So uh, if you'd like to see me cooking that, make a comment in the comments below and let me know if you'd like to see me cooking that and I'll put up another cooking video. Uh, my taco soup didn't get much leverage, but you know, it is what it is. And um, you know, I've been thinking about it and I'm following Mindy of Mindy's Diamond Moments lead for the new year. I'm gonna do what makes me happy on this channel. And you know what, if people like it, great. If they don't, fine, um, that's not a big deal. But um, I like throwing extra additional things into my channel, obviously, as you've seen, but let's get to this. Uh, if so. they didn't like the taco soup, I ate the whole pot. <laughs> it was so good. So uh, just, just saying. Several people have said they made it and they really liked it. So uh, we'll see what happens with the Thai basil chicken. If you don't like it, more for me. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so tonight, I could not wait to unbag this. I have not purchased from this company before, but um, Shay of Crafting with Shay uh, unboxed a couple of these pens. And I saw this one and I knew I had to have it. This is from Diamond Painting excuse me, Diamond Pen Pal. Diamond Pen Pal is an Etsy shop, um, and they do amazing uh, pens. They're, again, hand-turned. Um, some of them are non-roll. I can't remember if I bought a non-roll pen or not, and I'll show you what that means, but in addition to the pen they sent me, be inspired and express yourself. So, yep, those are going right down, right now, on my crafting table. I love these little stickers. Again, I love... Uh, surrounding myself with great sayings to inspire and to motivate me to keep chugging forward every day. I got a little polar bear eraser. Can they see that? It's yeah. tiny. It's T90. It's so cute. And then Smarties. I love Smarties. Gosh, these used to be my favorite candies when I was little, and I still love them. So thank you, Diamond Pen Pal. Let's get into this and see what I got. I cannot wait to see this. I love this pen. And again, they're not cheap pens, but they're worth it, I promise. Thank you, Diamond Pen Pal, for uh, sending me this. I, I purchased it, but I, can't wait. I haven't seen it. You're gonna see it with me. I'm so excited. All right. Wow, okay. Um, can I get into it? <laughs> okay, here it comes. All right. It comes without tips, but okay, if this is a non-roll pen, and by a non-roll pen, I mean it is flat on one side, so when you lay it down, it doesn't roll on you, which is great, but I had to have this. Look at the beautiful colors. Um, again, it's got clear acrylic, like a little leopard print design, and oh, I just, I loved it. And you can uh, put whatever tips you want. If you've got everlasting tips, if you've got, you know, tips from um, Distracted by Diamonds, she's got new tips in her store. You can put a single placer, a multi placer. Um, they let you put in the tips that you want to put in, whether that's plastic or metal, it doesn't matter. Um, I just loved that. Is that not elegant and beautiful? I can't wait to use it. I didn't know how it would feel with the non roll side, but. I'm, I'm liking it, and and it's light. Uh, again, a lot of these heavy ac or acrylic pens that are thicker are heavier. I really like this. Okay, I'm gonna try this out. Thank you, Diamond Pen Pal, for this. I love it. Oh, the pearl ends are beautiful too. Again, it's just an elegant, classy pen. Okay, thank you, Diamond Pen Pal. The next unboxing I have to do. I loved this one. I love Sherry Baldy. You know I do. I am an affiliate with Diamond Art Dreams. If you use my affiliate code, Kara10, you will get 10% off uh, a $50 or more purchase. Yes, do I get a kickback a little bit, but more importantly, you can save 10% on a purchase from Sherry Baldy. Uh, I have my invoice, which I'm going to put to the side because I don't want you to see it yet. 
what you get, and again, she packages everything beautifully. It comes in a brown box with all these cute stickers, a welcome letter. This is Sherry Baldy. And again, a certificate of authenticity. And for those of you not familiar with Diamond Art Dreams, which is Sherry Baldy's company, um, it is obviously legally licensed artwork because it is her artwork and she owns the company. So yeah, um, uh, again, here is her contact information, diamondartdreams.com, mybestieshop.com. So she's got an Etsy shop and then Diamond Art Dreams is her website. So go check her out right now. I saw today she is having a mega sale 30% off. So uh, go check that out and uh, get a Diamond Art Dreams painting. Oh, well. Obviously, this isn't for me. Um, yeah. <laughs> Inside, she also has her precious business card. Again, she's an artist. She's a colorist. She does all kinds of stuff. She has coloring books, coloring pages that you can uh, digitally download. But again, Diamond Art Dreams is her diamond painting company. Marlin. <laughs> okay, let's get the box tossed to the side. Oh, wait. Oh, you know what? She packed two candy packs. I didn't see this. This is mine. This has Laffy Taffy in it, but this is mine. So I'll put that right there for me. Don't take, no, 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 no. <laughs> All right. So she, again, has these things packaged so well. Thank you. Your order made our day. Uh, we hope opening this order makes your day. I am certain it will, and you will see why I got this painting momentarily. Will you take that, baby? Thank you. All right, let's not waste any time and just cut this open, because I know you guys want to see it. All right. Again, I throw everything down, and then I clean up, I promise. Got a little thank you sticker. Everything is wrapped so nicely. I love it. Okay, so... <clears throat> She's got it in a protective bag. It does have the canvas coat on it in case you store your paintings separately from your drills, which I do. What'd you get, Kara? What'd you get? Let's look. I will roll it back. It is poured glue. Okay, this is the top. Um, again, uh, poured glue has a clear cover. Double-sided adhesive has a white cover with sun or group or the like on it. Do not do this with double-sided adhesive or you can ruin your canvas. But since this is poured glue, I can roll it back. It is a very pliable canvas. It does have a very felty feel to it. Roll it back fast, 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 fast. So you can't see what it is. All right, and then you, I roll it back and I always zhuzh, 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 just a little bit. I'm gonna park this under my arm. You want to see what it is? It is down the rabbit hole. Mad Hatter Bestie Diamond Art Painting by Sherry Baldy. And when I went down the cricket rabbit hole, I thought, well, I went down a rabbit hole too. But look at her. Her hat. I mean, there are just so many elements in here that it is Alice in Wonderland. I love Alice in Wonderland. It's got the flying cards, clock, teapot. Uh, are there any other little creatures in there that I'm missing? No, it's just Alice. I'm not sure what that is. That look. Oh, I think it's a again a cup of tea, some cute little curly cute plants. But oh, I just loved her hat with the cards in it, and she has a mug that says "Drink Me" on it. Hmm. All right. There are forty colors with look it four ABs. Four ABs, those are down at the bottom. Um, again, this is her beautiful color inventory sheet. If you wanna stick this through a Xyron sticker maker, you certainly can. Um, again, 40 colors. Uh, it is a round diamond painting. Finally, finally, I've purchased a round diamond painting. Thank you, thank you, because everyone I've purchased recently has been a square. Let me roll this back so you can continue to look at her loveliness. Uh, I'm not going to show you the drills right now, but look at that. They are individually bagged, which I love because if you don't want to kit up, you can go right out of these bags. That is fantastic. Oh, yeah, y'all. Yeah. By the way, if you are new here, I'm Kara. This is a diamond painting channel. I sometimes throw in cooking. I sometimes throw in DIYs. If you're new and are liking what you're seeing and liking what I'm throwing down, 
Um, if you wouldn't, uh, would consider subscribing, hit that red subscribe button at the bottom. It's a red button. And then to the right of that subscribe button is a bell to let you know anytime I upload a video. And again, I'll upload another video uh, tomorrow. Also, for those of you in here, if you like this, please consider giving me a thumbs up. And again, commenting, do you want to see the Thai basil chicken or not? It doesn't matter if you comment, you don't want to see it or you want to see it. Um, giving me a thumbs up, even a thumbs down or commenting really helps my channel and I greatly appreciate it. So here is the basic toolkit, uh, pointy tweezers, uh, a big plate of wax, a boat with a funnel uh, for easy pouring of your drills and a diamond painting pen with a single placer and looks to be a three placer on the end. Um, she does sell specialty toolkits that um, you can purchase as well, but this kit is everything you need to start diamond painting if you are a new diamond painter. So let's see this. Sorry, dimensions are 60 by 60, so it is a perfect square and it's you know, it's not that big, but look at her. Oh, I love her. I love her. Look at that hat. Oh, I love the hat. And all the curls. Oh, and the key and the lock and oh, the flying cards. Oh, yeah. That is going to be so pretty. I'm going to peel this plastic back. Hopefully I don't rip it. Oh, I have a habit of doing that. Very very sticky canvas. Not a problem in the world. Let's get them up into the business of the drill field. I'm showing you light and dark uh, symbols. Looks to be that all of her symbols have the dark writing on them, but they're very clear. So again, with those threes, I can see, I can see there are threes and I, I don't have my nerdy magnification glasses on at all. So with, you know, just my regular eyesight, I can see that's three, even though it is dark. Um, again, very clear drill field. Love it. And again, um, never had a problem in the world with one of these canvases. I have done a Sherry Baldy canvas and completed it, which you have seen. Um, and again, uh, four ABs. One is the heart. One is a right arrow. One is a kind of a down arrow and one is like a trident thing. So let's look real quick. Hearts. All right, I see hearts all in her hat. I see hearts in the puffy sleeves of her dress. I see, oh, there are hearts all in this lock. Uh, all of this, uh, all of these, I didn't even notice. There's a beautiful border around this painting and all of these pink dashes, all of this at the top and on the sides are all ABs. Wow, that is gonna be, oh, so pretty. Next one is the right arrow. Right arrow is in her skirt. It is gonna be, where else is the right arrow? Okay, so the right arrow is also gonna be in these plants, these curly Q plants at the right and the left. Um, there's a little bit in her skirt. I don't see any of the, in her hat at the top. The next one is the blue downward. Looks to be a blue downward arrow, but it's different. Where is that? Blue downward arrow. Mm -hmm. You know me, sometimes these things elude me. I'm looking, not seeing them, and I'm not gonna let you watch me struggle for too long looking for them. Hmm. Okay, don't see them, and then uh, 40, is 5,200 and it is a white, looks like a trident. Okay, am I just blind or am I just missing them? There may just be a few of them that I'm just not seeing. I'll find them, they're in here, I promise you. Hmm. <laughs> not jumping out at me, but that's okay. Uh, we'll figure it out, but let's get into these drills, shall we? Is she not adorable? Oh. Okay, and again, I don't take 12 years to go over the colors, but I just want you to see the color palette. Ladies, out. woo, look at 37. There are our pink ABs, and when I tell you there are a lot of them in there, there are a lot of them in there. Kara, 
What does AB stand for? AB stands for Aurora Borealis. For those of you that are new diamond painters, Aurora Borealis has a special coating and you can tell the difference. I'm, I'm gonna hold up a regular drill versus an AB drill. You can see that that has a special coating that catches the light and facets of color and just makes the drills. Everyone all together, shim, shim, shimmy, shimmer. Just a little bit more. Okay. Oh, and here are our white ABs. And this is probably why I couldn't find them. There, there are not very many of them. I will find them, I promise. Some blues, greens, browns, rusty orange. Oh, here is another AB. And again, they're, oh, both of them. Okay, so here's the green AB. That's gorgeous. You can see if I wave it back and forth. You can see purples, you can see blues, that's gorgeous. And then this is a beautiful powder blue AB and you can see that, that uh, coating on there. Okay, laying them all out for you so you can again see, Oh, so pretty, love that. Kind of a cross between a Kelly green and a turquoise. Can they see all this? Mm -hmm. All right, ooh, again, so pretty. These colors, love them. There are a lot more dark colors than I thought. Okay, here's a pretty purple, yellow, a red, a rust. Okay. Get rid of that because I'm going to throw it on the floor anyway. This looks to be 310. It may be another darker color, but wow, all these, look, all these different shades of this turquoisey green, more yellow. Ooh. Ooh, look at this green that is beautiful so pretty and bright so here is the color palette and again another pink and kind of a mustardy yellow so that is going to be what we've got to work with on this painting guys love this color palette i'm gonna let you take a gander and now I'm gonna scoochie them over to the side. Again, individual bags I love because I put them in my Bella Art Day Nicole bag holder. Sorry, there's stuff all over it now, but um, here, <laughs> let me take these things off. Um, again, it's got her love Bella Art Day Nicole, by the way. Um, you just put the bags in order in this bag holder and it holds the bags and you can um, work straight out of the bags if you wanna put um, if you're having trouble with your bags, like if they have like a few in there and your bags start to flop over, you can just put a little card insert in there and it'll stand up. So not a big deal and you don't have to kit up. So love that stand and of course things falling on the floor. All right, let me flip her back over so you can take another gander. Oh. Again, down the rabbit hole, Mad Hatter Bestie. I just, I love this for so many reasons. And again, she will be going in my craft room. Again, you know, we've all gone down many rabbit holes in crafting and diamond painting. I know at least I have. Uh, if you have it, good for you. Um, yeah, we need to work together because I tend to do that. But yes, beautiful, beautiful Sherry Baldy. Thank you so much for this gorgeous image. Again, she is running a 30% off sale right now. Go check out Diamond Art Dreams. Um, she's got a lot of adorable diamond paintings um, that you can check out. Thank you, Diamond Pen Pal. I love this pen. It is very unusual. I've never gotten a non-roll pen before. So thank you for this, uh, Diamond Pen Pal. That's what I've got for you tonight. Don't forget to mention, if you want to see me cooking my Thai basil chicken, Marlon and I are now going to go enjoy that Thai basil chicken. And I will see you probably uh, tomorrow with another unboxing. I've got several to do. So I will leave you with this. In a world where you can be anything, be kind. This is the Principal Painter, and I am signing off.